Okay. But we want this to be fun and, you know, groovy. Can you be groovy? Depends. Is it still the 70s? Whatever. Just as long as it's informative and classy. Oh, of course it will be. Now, when you talk, do you think you could use acronyms like LOLs and WTH? <laughs> you, you could say OMG means OH MY GECKO! Um, I'm a bearded dragon? I, I, I know, but okay. Would you be prepared to fall down? Uh, come on, you've seen the videos. A cat tries to jump onto the kitchen counter and misses. A puppy tumbles adorably down some steps. That sounds horrifying! No, they're all absolutely fine. Probably. It's always dogs, dogs, dogs when we talk about social learning. Just because they can follow someone pointing in a field. I thought I was going to get the chance to change people's perspectives in this interview. Uh, trust me, uh, people pay more attention when you fall down or, or get stuck in something weird. Uh, okay, sorry, you're right, you're right. Let's go the classy route. Can you rap? I uh, heard you guys were good imitators, so uh, you could copy me. I am a groovy lizard and I'm here to say I imitate in such fantabulous ways. I could. Yay! I'm just not going to. Why don't you just cut to the person who actually knows their stuff? I decide when we cut and actually I don't want to right now. Learning from another animal, what we call social learning, is considered so difficult that for a long time we thought that only humans and other apes could do it. However, we've recently shown this ability in a number of reptiles. Tortoises can learn from other tortoises. Bearded dragons can actually imitate other bearded dragons. And this means that bearded dragons understand the relationship between their own behaviour and the behaviour shown by another animal. That makes them very intelligent, much more so than we previously thought. Animal welfare is strongly influenced by the cognitive needs of the animals concerned. With intelligence comes the capacity to suffer. We need to keep them in the very best way possible and give them things to do in their enclosure. If they're social animals, for instance, it might be better for them to be kept with others and, likewise, if they're solitary animals, they might prefer to be kept on their own. Let me tell you reptiles are smarter than we thought Only if you test them in conditions that are hot Because we learn from each other, yeah, we learn from life Learning just like humans, mammals, other animals, right? And if people now realise the depth of our smart You can make reptile keeping more a state of the art You can understand your beardy lizard or a soul snake And look after them properly, it's all for their sake, yeah! That was groovy! Are you sure I can't persuade you to fall down or... Oh, oh! You could squeeze yourself into a hamster ball. That would go viral. Sure, I'll just copy you. If that's what it takes. Okay, let me just... I didn't think you'd oh, actually... Get my head in here and... Seriously, the RSPCA have concerns that hamster oh. balls can be stressful and can cause injury. Ow. It's completely fine. Let me just stick that in there and... Ow! Ow! Um, I think I might be stuck. Can, uh... Can, can someone help me? Oh my gecko. <laughs> but seriously, I might really be stuck. Send for help. Hello? Don't be like Ken. 